The Forests and Fish Law set in motion an adaptive management program to continuously monitor and improve our forestry operations to protect fish habitat and streams and water quality. This is important because more than 60,000 miles of streams flow through our state and private forest lands. Our goal is to better understand how forestry operations impact streams and take steps to reduce or minimize those impacts during our timber harvesting operations and road building activities. This includes ensuring that road crossings are installed to let fish pass and that water from roads is diverted onto the forest floor, keeping sediment away from streams. It includes leaving wide enough buffers of trees to provide healthy riparian habitat. Leaf trees in buffers maintain shade for cool water temperatures. They provide large wood and streams to create feeding and resting pools for fish and spawning habitat in the channel. The no-touch zone along streams maintains bank stability to avoid increasing sediment to streams from bank erosion. Creating streamside riparian conditions that replicate a mature forest environment, also called desired future conditions, on the west side of the Cascades, and streamside riparian conditions that maintain fully functioning and healthy forest conditions on the east side of the Cascades. Priorities for research are established by the Cooperative Monitoring Evaluation and Research Committee, a collaborative group of stakeholders including forest landowners, federal and state natural resource agencies, Native American tribes, and the environmental community. The committee developed a work plan with more than 90 research projects related to specific forest practices rules. The range of topics covered in the projects include properly typing streams by identifying fish-bearing and non-fish-bearing streams, identifying and protecting channel migration zones where streams meander, providing protection during timber harvest operations for steep and potentially unstable slopes, properly constructing and maintaining the road system to prevent erosion and runoff from forest roads, repairing artificial barriers to fish passage, preventing forest herbicides from entering streams, identifying and protecting wetlands, and protecting wildlife. The Adaptive Management Program provides a continuous feedback loop of information to better understand how we can minimize the impact of forestry operations and restore and maintain healthy fish habitat and clean water in our working forest environment.